Right, today I'm going to show you how to resolve this very common problem a lot of us have, and that is DNS lookup error. I've just pulled down an image from uh, Google, Google Images, just put in a DNS lookup error, Google Chrome. Um, if you're using Google Chrome, you might just you say this page is not available, and Internet Explorer is probably the same thing. But so basically, you always, if you always get something like this, it's due to a DNS lookup error. So if you get this web page not available, this page not available, this website down, or is anything with reference to DNS lookup, um, it's because of the DNS lookup error. It's usually primarily due to the, the server having difficulty providing you with that um, service, or the servers down. Yeah. So today I'm going to explain two ways in which you can resolve this problem. And firstly, the first way is the you want to do is click on start. Then you want to type in cmd to open your command prompt. Um, once you're in your command prompt, you want to type ip config slash forward slash flush dns. And this one basically flushes a DNS or resolver cache. And sometimes this is Windows IP configuration system flush DNS resolver cache. And sometimes this basically resets the um, DNS cache and sometimes this is one sometimes this actually this is the only thing you have to do really sometimes um, just hit the flush of DNS and it may work and other times and I will also put this in the um, description as well and other times you may this may not work so um, another method I want to show you is so I'm going to start control panel and you want to, it says up here it says view by and most people have it in category, but I change it to small icons so it's much easier to find things I'm looking for. Um, much yeah, so I'm going to go small icons, then go network and sharing center, then change adapter settings, and then you will come up with all your current connections. And with your connection you're currently connected to, you want to right click, go into properties. And then it will come up with this thing here. Um, you want to, you may want to change it for both of these. You can change it for um, IPv6, but I don't think a lot of websites are using IPv6 at the moment. At the moment, so we'll just do IPv4. So yeah, you want to go down to IPv4. I hope you double click on it, and then you want to go to um, use the following DNS servers addresses. And this is DNS services provided by my um, IP address. Internet service provider, and I've just written down the ones you want to use are this. These are Google public DNS servers. So these are Google's basic DNS servers. These are never crash. So your preferred DNS server which you want to use is 8.8.8, .8 then .8. And alternate um, DNS server you want to put in is 8.8.4.4. So double eight four four. Preferred is 8.8.8. And basically, got them to put the numbers in, which uh, I will do now. If it's eight, and if it's eight, 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 then you want to put go to all these. If it's eight, or eight, and four, and four. I'm going to split it OK, OK, and that, so that's done. And that's how you resolve your DNS Google lookup server. So, this again, you can catch that 48 for the preferred, 28, 24 for alternates. Hope this film sort of helps you, and thanks for watching.